My husband and I have been in the restaurant business for over 50 years, starting with the Calfskin Cleaver restaurant. Well, we were no different than any of the other restaurants in Rancho Cucamonga. We got the word that we needed to close for business on March 18th. All restaurants and bars would close. As far as the business itself, we shifted quickly to a takeout menu. Well, we had done some takeout, but not a lot. It was not a principal part of our business. We developed a menu from our regular menu, a small selection that would travel well and be affordable. We feel very attached to the city of Rancho Cucamonga. Uh, we've been in business here since 1967 with the two restaurants, and we know many of the customers. We've developed a reputation over the years and a loyal, very loyal clientele in both restaurants. So many restaurants in California are independent restaurants like we are, and they don't have, they're not public companies, they don't have deep pockets. A lot of the smaller ones, the, the, what we call mom and pops, may not be able to make it. And I think that's very sad because I think that's what gives so much of the local color to so many of the cities in, in California, are the people, the locals. I think what I've learned from this, but I've also learned this from being in the restaurant business for over 50 years, is you have to be adaptable. Get to know your community and get involved in the community and get involved in finding out who the leadership in the community is because Rancho Cucamonga, the people of this, the uh, uh, city government of Rancho Cucamonga has been very helpful to us, always. Very friendly relationship and it's a very, a very well-run city.